Greetings, Lunarians and Brigandine fans. I am your host, Valgus Sonari, back with another episode on the Holy Gustave Empire LP with Brigandine, the Legend of Nursia. Hopefully, everybody's having a great day today. I may be having a great day or a bad day. <laughs> this is going to be a tough fight right here. This is a defense battle, as you have seen from the last episode. Rudo is here. It's my first time fighting him, and uh, from what I've been uh, seeing and what I've been told and stuff like that, he can easily one-shot one unit, whoever he decides to uh, attack, because of his crazy ability and he has um he has his class up right now he's an overlord look at this yeah once we once we witnessed that scene uh with alson and he was reporting to us like the uh um the updates on the manaslisi theocracy he then turned into an overlord so we're we're gonna feel it so uh they're almost here i may be able to pass the turn and see if they uh, come in here if not then i will cut the footage as needed let's see what happens so, he's not in range. He's in the water. Okay. Okay. I wonder if, like, uh... I don't think he can get to the bridge right away. But if he, like... Nice crit. Very nice. Um, But if he decides to, like... Go one tile to the right. I don't know if he can reach the bridge. But then one more turn later then, right? I don't know. It's up in the air. Regardless, uh, since he is in the water, we don't have to deal with him like right away, it seems. So let me check his movement real quick. Yeah, he's debilitated right now. He'd have to go off of the water and then come on the bridge after that. I'm surprised he didn't actually go onto the bridge because I think he could have gotten here or maybe even here. Um, so I checked his movement beforehand to make sure he wasn't going to be able to get in here. But still, anyways, uh, too much talking. Let's <laughs> uh, hit some things up here. We have a hidden away. Um, it would be really, really beneficial if I can take out this Phoenix, but it's going to be tough because it's fire on fire. Um, so, but it's not. So here's here's a question. Like, I thought. Well, that's right. That's right. I keep on forgetting that uh, the resistance works in the opposite direction and not the same element. I'm still in OG Brigandine mindset. You have to forgive me. Um, this right here is resistance to red because they're blue. Um, and you have extra damage on me, but it's not as much. Let's see. Do I focus the Phoenix? Because I do have Acid Breath. I do have Curse. I do have a Flame from back here, but I do want to save it for Heal Voice. Although, I don't think I can use two Heal Voices. Um, I'll check the MP once the Phoenix gets its turn. But, uh, yeah. Let's see if we can focus down the Phoenix. Whatever we end up hitting up is going to get healed regardless. Because there's Angels, there's Nightmares, there's Leaders... Everything has a damn heal on this uh, attacking unit. So this is very dangerous. But we'll see if we can uh, survive it. We do have a centaur shot, hopefully from somewhere. Um, it would have to be way back here. And it is a flyer, so that would be definitely beneficial. Let's go over here and do it. And then, uh, let's see. You're resisting it a little bit, but it's flying. 94%. Yes, go. Nice crit. Yes. If I can kill this Phoenix, that'll be huge. That will be huge. Um, The question is, do I need to move the dragon and get another hit? Because I know Null, even though he's a fighter right now, I'm trying to class him up with that. Because he's mastered Rogue. He does have moving away. So we can get in there, hit, get out. Uh, There's a curse. Flame with the Phoenix, potentially. There's a lizard guard right here. Or high lizard man. Um... Still waiting for that champion medal. <laughs> uh, putting Gaspar in the front is not a good idea at this current time. Now, let's see. I don't want to move things out of range of the heal voice yet. Once that once that is expelled, then I will move things out of range. But for right now, we need to keep things in order. Um, how about we slap a protect on the dragon? That might be the best option. Or... Wait, no, no, I can't silence the heal voice, can I? I can silence the flame attack, but... I'm just curious, what is that percentage? 46, eh. Okay. We'll just protect the dragon. Awesome. The only protect we get. Man, I really, really wish that the imps could do two protects at the uh, at level one, like the original pixies could in the original game. Would have been really nice. So... Okay, I don't want to break formation. I will breath as needed. So, let's end. Stand firm. 
All right, let's see. You do not have movement away. He just mastered uh, Swordsman. Um, I forgot to change him, actually, at 15. That's okay. Uh, this is definitely a breath attack from here. How much is it? 46? God. Why is it so low? 58, 46 back here. Okay. I mean, we're going to do it anyways. So. That is so bad. That is so bad. You have gear, or is it simply just your tier 2? Defensive capabilities. Yeah, it must be. Dang. Alright. It's tougher than I thought. Oh, let's see. You don't have any skills other than just the regular quick cut and steal. So, Seth, unfortunately, is not going to be doing much in this battle. But uh, we'll see what we can do. I can get an extra hit this way. Prism shot gives me 58. See, why does this do more damage than the dragon breath attack? I don't understand that. This is fine. <laughs> I gotta blow something up here. Uh, I think that's gonna be it. No heals necessary yet. We should be okay. But yeah, save the MP. Alright, that'll work. Okay, here's the unit that's going to get this done. Hopefully. Um, can a curse do it right away? Almost. Almost. I should do a curse, get in there with a hit on null. If I can hit. Let me see the percentage. 95. If that misses, I'm going to be so pissed. <laughs> I don't want to use a flame with a phoenix. Um... How much MP is the heal voice? I have access to two heal voices. So yeah, I can't afford to use a flame. I will if I have to, but like, it's in my best interest to just keep it, right? So, curse. Hopefully I do not have to use the lizard man. Alright, Null. Let's go, boy. Counting on you. We can do it. Nice. Excellent. All right, Phoenix down. That's a big kill, actually. That debilitates a lot of their healing potential. So, we're Gucci. Stand by. Stand by. Awesome. All right. How are your guys' playthroughs going? How are your defensive battles going? I'm curious to see if you've been, like, uh, overrun by this type of army. I'm sure you have at this point, so... <clears throat> By all means, if I was not making uh, YouTube videos for this game, um, I'd be right there with you guys. Um, but uh, yeah, as it is, uh, taking, uh, doing recording and editing takes time. So We're definitely getting holy worded next turn by the Archangel. At least no Divine Ray, which is fine. Okay. So, granted, if I do lose like any Monster Terudo's big attack in uh, this battle... It's not going to be that bad, but I actually might try to bait him out with the uh, elemental. Because once I use one more, I am I think I'm out. So, let's see. This thing right here, man. You are white, though. I could blow you up with black magic. I really could. This actually might work out because we are going in a row. Got a prism shot. If Rudo goes next and doesn't have access to his tier 2 dragon, he might burn his main attack on the elemental, but he also might do it on the dragon. I have to heal the dragon this round, clearly. But because he has protect, he might not blow it on the dragon. Or if he does, he may not kill it. Then again, it's Rudo's attack and, uh, yeah. <laughs> Even with protect on, I'm still scared of it. So, this imp is now, uh... Almost completely useless. Um, we have some. We have one silence left, so we need to move you into range to like hit up an angel potentially. So we might get killed in the process. <laughs> it's four spaces away, right? Yeah. Okay. So if I'm here, I should be able to reach you. One, two, three, four. Yes. Um. One, two, three, four. You can reach Rudo as well. I don't see myself silencing him. Uh, I know he has divine ray, right? Um. Yeah, be here. Okay, let's do a heal. Boom. Okay. 
Level 10. Very nice. Very nice. I'm actually going to Pegasus out of that one so I can do some Halos. Um, I hate getting counterattacked by this thing, but it has to happen, right? This is 98 and 156. God. God. <laughs> okay. Nice crit. We're getting some nice crits on this spot right here, yo. It's a miss. Oh, wow. That's so perfect. That is so perfect. Oh, my God, dude. If I can focus down these tier 2 monsters in this fight, the leaders are going to kill some stuff. There's no question. And they may even stay without any of their monsters left. But... Regardless, it's going to debilitate their combat power by a ton. So, hopefully we can pull that off. I still don't want to break formation. Um, you are getting shot. <laughs> so, this is 74. Do it. Since we're going in a row, I think we can get this thing. I'm pretty sure we can get this thing. I just wish Gaspar could be in a good position to do some damage, but... He's really not at this current time, so he's pretty much being saved for later. Or if, like, something has to be replaced in the front line. So, I just hope we can support him good enough, you know what I mean? Um, let's see. We just can't let a leader get hit by Rudo's attack. Because <laughs> that will suck. Um, let's see. We have one curse left. This is definitely the thing to use it on, if not a leader. It would be nice to use it on a leader, yes. But, then again, this is a tier 2 dragon. So, very dangerous. Um... Yeah, okay. End right here. Don't break. Okay, breath attack. We do have a breath attack still, right? Yeah, it's 50. 50. They they upped the cost of these uh, breath attacks, didn't they? So, like, the original cost was 40. Um, They upped it to 50 in this game. 20 dam 24 damage to Rudo. <laughs> Granted, you know, I, I see that for sure. But, yeah, okay. Anyway. What was the cost of the breath attack for the tier 2 dragons? In uh, the original. Was it 75? No, it wasn't that much, was it? No, 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 it was 50. Yeah, it was 50, right? Uh, the red dragon got 50. The white dragon was 50. The Bahamut and the tier 3 dragons was like 55 cost. Um, I don't want to heal anybody, actually. I want to save my magic. So, so far we're doing great on heals. So we got the phoenix. Um, let's see. I have to be able to... Try to bait Rudo's attack to something weak. This right here might be the best spot to do so. Because I don't think Kyle can get in there and uh, and hit me. Because Rudo's going to go first anyways. But I might get Divine Raid by you. Which is fine. I don't care about a Divine Raid being wasted on a weak monster anyways. Just, yeah. Um, yep. Go. Nope. Nice. Um, let's see. I really feel like I have to get another hit on this thing, but... Let's see. Crap. I'm realizing something. I took Noel's spot. No. No. Um, okay, we can make this work. The only problem is, if he goes to this forest tile, I don't know if he's going to be able to get back. That's the problem. So, but he needs this spot to hit this thing. Uh, I may have just screwed up. Um, I was too focused on getting that hit and staying in the command range. Okay. Uh, let's see what we can do. If we go up here, we break formation from the Phoenix heals. Even though we do have other singular heals. Not a bad thing. We can just heal and then come back. But are you in range of anything else? Um... No, not really. I think you're good to move and do one hit, depending on how it looks. 102 and 121. Um, yeah, do it. Nice. Okay, we'll bring him back next turn. Hmm. I hate it. Hang on. What's your power? Your strength is 96. Attack 104. Your attack is 91. God. Dragons really did get a nerf in this game, didn't they? My god. Tier 1 dragons? Weak. 
Um, I understand why, though, because, man, they were stupid powerful in the original. All you had to do was just spam dragons and good game, you know what I mean? Yeah, don't break formation. Um, something could go here. No, what, is, what does your unit look like? You know what? If I can manage it, I might go up here, hit with Null, and if I can get back to this tile right here, not guaranteed, um, then I can replace that space with the Lizard. But that would be a forest tile. Man, why did I have to do this right here? That was such a bad move. Um, your mobility is f four? It's five. Okay. So it's one, two, three, probably four, because being adjacent to the monsters and also being in a forest, <laughs> it's up in the air, man. I don't know. Um, tier two dragon. Not tier two dragon, level two dragon. I, I'm thinking out loud very much right now. Forgive me. Yeah, stay. Okay. Worst case scenario, we can flame with the Phoenix. Um, we're definitely cursing it, so let's do that first. Nice. Hell, if we can kill it with Null, we might actually be able to come back to this spot. Can you do it? You can. There we go. Atta boy, Null. Atta boy. Can you move back? No! Not a chance! Oh my gosh. Battle's over. Battle's over. That's a shame. Um, yeah, he's gonna get hit. I'm in range of like two divine rays. He's gonna die. Damn. Question is, was it worth it? I don't know. I actually don't know if that's worth it or not. Because Rudo's next. Ah, uh, man. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. We're in trouble. I thought he could get he could get back there, man. With five movement? Like... Oh, that's three, isn't it? Yeah, that's three. Wow. That's okay. We'll see what happens. But I think he's going to die this round. Uh, that's going to get you killed as well. Who I really care about in the enclosure. I could move the lizard here. Me moving this right here was the worst move. That was the worst move. Little tiny detail, man. Uh... He does have Divine Ray, right? It doesn't matter. He's going to come in here and swing. No, he doesn't. He's just going to come in here and use this. Which is insane. Yep. I think battle's over, yo. I hate to say that. I really do. But, like, from what I'm seeing now, I think it's over. Um... It's not really going to matter, is it? Well, no, it will because, like... Well, no, Kyle has Divine Ray. It really isn't going to matter. <sighs> yep, stand by. Damn. That was fun. <laughs> uh, let's see. It seems as if the problem is going to be on the left-hand side. So my formation is already botched right now. I've got to change it with the Phoenix. But this right here may be the better option. Okay. Oh, man. It's great that we killed off two Tier 2 monsters. But losing this defense right here is a problem. A big problem. We're going to have to go in with Tim's team. 
Wow, no way! He actually burned it on the elemental? Yeah. Rudo. Rudo. Holy crap, man. I lost my lizard, man, but that's okay. I thought Null was gonna bite a freaking bullet. Yikes. Okay. We're still in a bad situation. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> but we're in a better situation, if I can call it that. Um. Damn. Okay, so he's burned his attack. That's fine. Um, that's perfect, actually, but it's what we want uh, from him. Uh, he can't do God's Puppet. All he's really doing is just basic attacks, which are still stupid powerful. The attack is 192. Freaking nuts. Let's see. Why would you even choose to do it that way? 42, 94. Go. <laughs> I'm wondering, like, if we can survive the counterattacks from this dude. Like, I'm not seeing it, man. The dude is just like, he screams intimidation. Screams intimidation. With 840 health, like, he's not even in range of a curse. I don't even have a curse anyways, but... Yeah. I have two Venoms, looks like, yeah. This is bad, because since they, uh took my attack power down, that reduces the heal potential. That's pretty bad. I'm gonna have to do a heal voice this round as well. Just do not hit this thing. It's gonna get healed, but, you know, don't waste the damage. Like, I'm just curious. What is the counterattack like? It's... <laughs> That's insane, man. This dude is overpowered as shit. Oh my goodness. He is so overpowered. I hate it. <laughs> I really do. I want to try to kill the angels in the back. Pinto shot would be lovely, but like... Yeah. I'm bound to lose a lot of things here. I'd have to be here with it. What's the silence potential? 23%. One, two, three, four. Let's get in range of the other angel back this way. One, two, three, four. Yeah, okay. And instead of going closer to Rudo, <laughs> let's see. We have to be in the lake, though. One, two, three. Yeah. Man. Battle's tough, yo. Yep. Go. Nice. Hmm. I can't take this dude on, man. I really can't. Look at that. 303 with a normal attack. Because of all those orbs getting the extra att attack power. That is insane. I, I honestly don't know what to do. I'm kind of stuck, to be honest. I can bring you back and heal you. Or you can go back to the castle. Wow! What was the percentage? Did you guys see it? I didn't even look. What was the percentage? Wow. Wow. Also, I'm just curious right now. Does this have a chance to miss? It's got increased accuracy. But against the right unit, 
That could also miss as well, right? But my god. <laughs> what was the percentage? <laughs> Let's see. Closer. <laughs> yeah! Hmm. That was a very, uh, strange round. I'm gonna call it strange. Seth, you're almost dead. I gotta back you off. Since the Phoenix is there, you'll heal Seth anyways. I don't need to spend this heal right here, because I do plan on doing heal voice. Um, let's see. Honestly? Maybe not. I might actually save it, because the dog will heal from the castle. The dragon is a little bit low. But I could just heal Seth with this unicorn. I don't know, actually. Do I wait one, one more round? The breath attack coming in from the uh, giant snake. I'm sort of conflicted. Um, How much is it? 178? I mean, you'll still be a little bit down anyways. Yeah, do this. Okay. Uh, we'll come we'll come to that uh, little trouble spot when we get to it, so. Oh, man. This formation. I wish I could just, like, swap directly these two units. There's no way to do that in one round. I wish there was a spell like that, where you could take, like, one unit and another unit and then just swap them right away. You could call it, like, there's a, there's an ability in Divinity Original Sin 2 called Nether Swap, and it does exactly that. It swaps uh, two different units, or two different, like, objects, because you can swap objects as well in the game. Anyways, uh, no more Breath Attack for you. Stand by, you got Protect. You have full breath. Is this water? Yeah, that's water. Okay. My god. Alright, Rudo. I'm gonna have to try to focus you down, man. 82. Yep, go. Be awesome if we can get a poison, but we can't. Because of the brigandine. You need to get the hell out of dodge. Uh, however... Oh, you have charm, don't you? Let me see. This isn't a big chance on, like, anybody. You can't be charmed, obviously. Uh... Zero percent chance on Kyle. Um... Good charm, this thing. It's 40%. It's not too bad. Or do I hit something? Uh, let's see. I could do power break and then get the hell out. 75% chance. That's a lot of damage. Not bad. It doesn't cost any MP either. That's still good damage, but 100% chance. Uh, you have 89% chance to hit me. You'll be healed anyway. It doesn't matter. So. Yeah, hit this one. Nice. Mm-hmm. Okay. Get out. Everything's in range, right? Yeah. Y'all, this is an intense battle. My brain's going insane right now. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Uh, do I pop a heal voice now? I know it will heal this thing. I'm not worried about that. Precisely why I hit the one in front. We get a heal from the castle, but the leaders are still down. Dragon in front is still down. Yeah, it's time. Okay, do this. Okay. Not too shabby for my uh, attack power being reduced. <laughs> it's still a great heal. Like, the greatest heal in the game. So. You can, like, uh, get a more powerful heal by having a ton of intelligence, you know, with a, a bishop or something like that, or a cardinal, but... 
<laughs> Only three units with the holy word. Well, that's beautiful. Knew that one was coming. God, 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 God. Like, I know what's coming. I'm just, I'm never ready for it. Rudo definitely goes on record as, like, the scariest character in Brigandine to face. Including the, the original games. Like, you know, we had Kador, we had Zemeckis and stuff like that. Very heavy hitters, even Dinadan. Uh, going up against all those crazy heavy-ass leaders. Rudo... Those guys can't even touch that that dude, man. He's just way too good. Way too good. Let's see. There's too many heals backing you up, man. I hate it. I hate all of it. <laughs> you are out of MP, which is amazing. You haven't even started using your MP. You have Holy Word, don't you? Yep. He's gonna pop Holy Word next time for real. He only has one granted, but... Your intelligence is bad, isn't it? I was looking over you. Uh, your intelligence is garbage. Why is this dude a freaking cardinal? It's terrible, man. Why are you a cardinal? Um, the dude needs to be something different. <laughs> See, unless you just give him a shit ton of potions. Excuse my French there. Let's see. We can always try to, like, bait the heals out of, you know, Kyle... And I don't think... No, Rudo doesn't have any magic. But out of Kyle and the other angels. By really uh, bringing uh, some things down low. That way they don't heal Rudo in the process. I just gotta like... Keep hitting the angels back here. Because if I get this one this low. This won't incite a heal. Or encourage a heal. Incite doesn't make any sense in that sentence. <laughs> nice crit. Okay. Um, Silence doesn't even have a chance to work on uh, Kyle. No, it's zero. So, might as well do this one. The other one moved out of range, so it worked. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Let's see. We do have heals left. So, we got a breath attack here. Do it. I was taking, like, close to nothing right there. Awesome. <clears throat> All right. Let's see. We're still in it, man. We're still in it, so. Not bad. I wonder. Your mobility is what? It is six. Okay. This is meadow. This is meadow. That's prairie. That's three. But I'm afraid you won't be able to come back. So, I'm not going to be moving Gaspar in range of anything. Because if he gets in range of Kyle and Rudo, he's dead. So, I may move him back and open up a space for the Hellhound, potentially. Uh, hitting Rudo. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah. One of those things, you know. Yeah, stand by. Okay. Let's try to get a hit over here. It's still gonna hurt. He hits me. Yeah, okay. Look, it's 100% accuracy for him to hit me. What was the percentage last time I tried to hit him? Because... Yeah. Uh, you, you can understand my confusion there. Nice crit again. Is that... Is that tile, like, bugged or something? <laughs> Anybody that moves into that tile and instantly gets critted? Man, why can't you get back to the tile? Uh, he passes through Rudo. That's why that happens. Or doesn't happen, rather. Gotta heal the dragon. <clears throat> alright, alright, alright. We're fine. We're fine. We can, we can survive a little bit longer than I thought. I thought we were done as soon as I made that, uh... Mistake with Null, but we're good. Okay. Start doing breasts this way. Do not take any counter damage, please. Because that would be blue on red. That's weakness. I don't want that. Okay. I wish you liked Forest, man. I wish you liked Forest. You would if I didn't change you to a freaking thief. I just didn't anticipate us getting attacked by, uh, Rudo. So, I didn't even think about changing him, uh... When I moved him, so. Hmm. That's out of heals. The dog is going to have to go on the castle. But this has to be for the dragon. 
The Phoenix is in danger. <laughs> uh, actually, I may heal the Phoenix, to be honest. Do you have MP left? No, you're out. Uh, that's a toss-up, yo. Phoenix is tier 2, and I need him for another heal voice. Gonna get hit with weakness. Holy word right here. Yeah, I think I need to heal the uh, Phoenix. Yep. I'll be losing that dragon in front, but... If I can afford to keep the Phoenix, that's going to be pivotal, so... 35 minutes into this battle? Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. Taking some time on this one, so hopefully I can fit two uh, battles in this uh, episode. I should be okay. Um... You cool. Do I move and take a hit? 88% because you're in the freaking water. Yeah, these giant snakes are definitely going to be a problem because of the, ter of the terrain. Uh, holy word. Nothing else, really. Yeah, go. Mm-hmm. Okay. Stand firm. I need you to survive. <laughs> Can't be uh, attacking with you. Gotta do a venom. Man, I wish you could reach that angel. I can't really get a good hit in a way attack with Null unless I move the Phoenix, which I could, but where do I move the Phoenix? On the castle? Like, I need the dog to go to the castle. The castle would be the best spot for the Phoenix for sure, but. Okay, let's just hit up Rudo right here. Dark attack might as well. That may actually uh, encourage a heal. We'll see. I think I'm going to move the Phoenix and then get in there and hit with Null. So, you go here. I'll worry about the Hellhound later. So. Okay, you what do you have? What is that buff that you have? Oh, Halo, what is that? Hold up. I should know, but I'm blanking right now. What is that buff? Regen. Blue peel. Right, 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 right. Okay. Should you? Um <laughs> You both have blue peel. I thought the top one didn't. Yikes. Okay, listen. All these shenanigans, man. <laughs> I'm kidding. All these, uh, all these angels for real, though, give me a hard time. Uh, let's see. We may be able to prevent a holy word from you. You actually might heal this angel. So, let's get this one low, I think. Yeah, go. Nice. That's fine. Nice level. Noel's putting in the work, like he usually does, but it's not going to be enough to win this fight. We'll see where the heals are going to go, though. If they go in the right places, then I may have a chance, but... Even then... <clears throat> I told you that, like, these next few battles are going to be pure bloodshed, and it's living up to the name, so... Wow, a lot of heals on that uh, one round there. So, you know what I wish they would do right here? Instead of, like, giving us each individual heal, just... Show it all on screen at once, like we do with area heals and heal voice and holy word damage and stuff like that. Show all the numbers at once, you know? So. Did Rudo get healed? He's gonna kill my centaur. Yep. <gasps> oh my goodness. Water terrain came in clutch for me. Oh my god. Let's go on record and say that this battle is being won, won by RNG. The balance is tipping because of good RNG. Like very good RNG. <laughs> Holy crap, man. My Hellhound and High Centaur have survived freaking murder today. That's fine. I don't care about that. Wow. Okay. 
Pause. I gotta cut right. Take a break. <laughs> okay, I had to get up and stretch for a second. Okay, let's continue. So, um, we're out of MP. Yeah, she's done. Uh, we do have a flame spell, but that's not really gonna help. Did he get healed? I didn't even notice it, because he's like... But, is his, like, static heal that powerful? Or is heal over time? He has that, right? No, he's got counter dam counter damage up S. That's why he had so much damage. My god. Um, no, he doesn't have a uh, static heal. He must have gotten healed, like, generically. Yeah, I just missed it. Okay. Which is fine. You know, I knew it was going to happen, but... You're silenced. You've got plenty of heals left. You're in range of Rudo. This thing is completely spent. They're not even worried about that thing. So. No silence is there. you got plenty of silences here. Oh, boy. I wish the centaur was in range. I would definitely use my last heal voice here. It'd be perfect. You have no purpose right now, demon. Okay. So the way I'm seeing it is that either we retreat now and get everybody out because we're going in a row, we'll be safe and we won't lose any more monsters. Or we just uh, we stick it out and try to kill a few more things. But the leaders are so powerful in this particular fight that they are going to stay even though uh, their monsters are gone. You know what I mean? We've got an area, not an area, a holy word coming over here as well. He won't reach a lot. I think he'll just reach like these two, maybe even three. But regardless, um, you're out of MP. You're not even going to be in the fight. <laughs> Why did they loop heal this golem? It, they did. Why did they loop heal this Whatever. Um, it's, it's a toss-up for me because they do have heals left. There's a heal here. There's three heals here? Yeah, there's three heals here. Plenty of heals here. They, they've got plenty. Just... I feel like I need to go. Or do I use one more heal voice and stick out one more round? Can I? I don't know. I think I'm feeling heal voice and stick it out. Because I don't believe that they could kill, like, even just one monster. Um, when they're at full health. This being close to full health. My unicorns are out, right? Yeah. Yo, my brain. Okay, here's what we'll do. We'll stick it out. One more round. When it comes around, back around to Null's turn, then we'll, we'll bail. So, <laughs> Hopefully it's worth it. We'll find out. Okay. Uh, demon might as well get out of range of breath. Yeah. So. Get the hell out. <laughs> um, we'll do a heal voice now. I wish the centaur was in range, but it's okay. Alright. It's still very fruitful. Very fruitful, actually. So. Won't be too bad. Very nice. Okay, we can back this off. Uh, man, I really wish I could kill one of these angels, man. I'm I'm gonna hate that they're gonna have gonna be keeping these angels after I leave here. Like it's really unfortunate. Um, especially this one. Level eight. Yep. Okay. Uh, perfect spot for a centaur is here. Replace the demon spot. Do we still hit up the angel? I would like to kill something. <laughs> right? Um, yeah. You have a breath. You do have a breath. It might kill it, because I think it did, like, what, 93 damage to it last time? 
It's got potential. You have, like, no potential back here. <laughs> this thing is basically done. Um, if I move you here, are you really in that much danger? 107, 100. Yeah, go. Go, 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 go. Nice miss! This thing's coming in clutch, man. I love this hellhound. Keeping it forever. Keeping it forever. I'm not even changing its name because its name is awesome. Rapsodo. Rapsodo. I love the name. <laughs> I'm bugging out over here. I'm sorry. Uh, let's... Yeah, I don't want to hit with anything else, literally, man, because if I do, they may actually kill one of the frontline running dragons. If my intentions are to leave after this round, then that's what I must do. Uh, Kyle cannot get into hit Gaspar. Let's see. This dragon might actually bite the dust. <laughs> we'll see. What are you? You're the level 8 one. Mm, I hate it. But that's okay. We'll try to save the imp if we can. If we can. Oh, this battle's got my brain on fire. All right. Can we kill this angel with a breath? If not, I'll just go to the left. So. Oh, no, we can't. I thought it would be enough. I thought it did 93 to that last one. And a 68, I could get the kill with Seth. That might be worth it, actually. Let me see. Can we actually do that much damage as a thief? For sure. Yeah, why am I even questioning it? So. Alright, we'll breath to the left. Why not? There's no killing the angel. It's unfortunate. Because that's really like their um, meat and potatoes behind their armories, you know? Heals for days, divine rays for days, holy words for days. Whole bunch of religion going on here, man. <laughs> so, uh, let's see. All right, get some levels, Seth. You deserve it. Seth is a really good knight. I just don't like his command range. Like a lot of these rune knights that are decent, um, and decent too good by themselves, come with like piss poor command range. It's really bad. Um, anyways. Let's move you out of range. More space here. You stay. Alright, let's see if we can survive this. One monster may may die. But... They're kind of like... Um, they're almost out of juice. They really only have heals going for them and just massive physical attacks with Rudo and Kyle. Yep. Saw that one. It might die from the uh, giant snake hit. Really? Really? Interesting. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. I didn't see that one. Heal. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Breath attack. Yeah, right. I should have called it. Oh my god. Area heal? My dude, this guy has no business being a freaking cardinal. Change his class. Like, man. Devs, I wish I could speak to you because I want to know your intentions behind this guy right here. Why is he a cardinal? It makes no sense. Why is he a cardinal? Did you type it in wrong? <laughs> Did you type it in wrong? Look at his agility. His agility is 80. His intelligence is 65. Flip it. <laughs> Just flip it. Oh, man. I'm sorry. I'm bugging out over here again. Just, I, I have to say something. Uh, let's see. Okay, we have got to leave now. We're not winning the fight. That, that much is clear. But you got put into range I may be able to take you out this this could be possible so what I have to do is uh try to maybe enclose you if I can the centaur is going to get a big hit on this thing and if I do enclose if I can pull off enclosure which I should be able to easily 
Yeah, it's dead. It is for sure dead. I'm killing their freaking uh, Archangel. Their perfect Archangel at that. That's three tier two monsters killed within this defensive battle that I couldn't win, but I'm going to take the win anyway. That is a win in my book for sure. So, all right, because we can come back from this. All right, let's get what we can with uh, attack, physical attacks here. 91%. Yep, go. Nice. Right? Because we're leaving anyway. Might as well milk the experience. Don't mind me. This is where it would be nice to have a fast forward button. <laughs> you can double tap on YouTube video. Uh, let's see. Mm hmm. 29 experience. Are we excited to see all this little micromanaging experience stuff? Retreat to where? I know this is a crossroads. Uh, let's see. Tim is. Tim is here. We need to go back to Belfarum. Yep. We definitely need to go back to Belfarum. And then take back this castle with Tim's team. Because Rudo's going to have the mana to replenish all that. So let's go to Belfarum. It's unfortunate, Seth, my boy. We did put in work, though. We did put in work. Okay. Man, that is out of the freaking command range. Okay, hang on. Do I do... No, I can't do a freaking flame attack. I'm going to have to just do this. Right? Yeah, it's going to have to be like this. That's fine. This is 75. I could kill this angel. But I heavily feel I should be killing the archangel. You know what? That's going to move out of the way. We're going to hit with you. Hit with you. You have... Th what? You have 373? I may be able to actually kill that angel. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Let me see something. Can you move one more? I have an idea. Okay. All right. This is 100%, right? It's 93. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. All right. I have an idea. Let's see. Because we know we can get around here. Out of the range, it's fine. A lot of damage <laughs> against me. <laughs> but uh, you're retreating anyway, so. 25. Holla at me. Alright. Time to go. Oh boy. That was a long battle, yo. 45 minutes about, yeah. Maybe even longer. Okay, we gotta move the unicorn out of the way. First of all. And enclose with you. <laughs> if we have to, which we might. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's enclose. Why not? We'll enclose with the imp. See? You had a purpose. You had a purpose. <laughs> Oof. Oof. What a crit. All right. Still going. We got it. We got it. So this is an Archangel. Um, the other two were what? What else did I kill? Can't remember at the time. Uh, what else did I kill? Oh, a tier 2 Holy Dragon. Can the Centaur actually do 134? Oh no. It's a crit. Rhapsodo, you are MVP. I'm never getting rid of this guy. Oh my gosh, it's so good. <laughs> this thing is... This thing has evasion tanked like crazy. Even more so than a freaking Bahamut. I don't know why I'm going back here, but... Oh no! No way, dude. Oh, I hope you crit, but... Come on! Come on! That is such garbage, man. I thought the crit from the Hellhound guaranteed it.
Come on, man. I should have hit it with the Phoenix. I should have hit it with the Phoenix. I was too greedy. It's not worth me staying here and losing all these monsters this round just to get the kill with Gaspar. I gotta go. Come on. Freaking 2 HP, man. That really grinds my gears. Oh, I hate it. That's all right. That would have been beautiful, man. That would have been beautiful. I should have committed to hitting with the Phoenix. Oh, well. I thought I had it in the bag for sure because, like, I had so many hits on that thing. Oh, well. Shit happens, as they say. I'm not sorry for my French on that. <laughs> okay, so looking at the big picture of it, we lost much less than they did. We took out an angel, we took out a tier 2 holy dragon, took out a phoenix, we took out a giant snake, and we almost got that archangel. Uh, but, yeah, we had to back off, so it's okay. It's okay, we uh got rid of some good stuff. So I'm not completely upset about that one at all. So. Alright, quest results, what we got? Another night. Tomas came through. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Training here. Very good. I'm trying to get Ivan's training up so he can uh, master his tier 1 class currently. Which I think is uh, Thief. I think he's going to Thief right now. I'm going to see all this. Alright, we have a scene. Matt. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is... I've been wondering about this since we recruited Malik. We actually get to see a scene with this. As soon as Tomas had led him into the dimly lit barracks, a familiar voice cried out to him. うちへ帰ろう。待て。私からこのキス様にお願いしたの。私を誘拐してって。お前、何を言ってやがる。どうしてそんなことを俺がどれだけ心配したかわかっているのか。たとえ娘のお前でもやっていいことと悪いことがあ
これからもよろしく頼むぜ The cold expressionless look Malik had worn for so long finally returned to that of a loving father. HP is increased by 20, strength is increased by 5. Okay, okay. Decent. Nice little boost there. That's interesting because, like, um, that's the first time I've seen, like, stat increases from questing. You know how we used to get that all the time, like,、uh, randomly on the original games, but. Right now, we can just get them through training, right? By leveling up. But we couldn't really level up in the other games, anyways, through questing, unless we just got lucky and got experience from questing, which was rare. But now we can get it every single turn. So it's interesting to see stat growth from actual quests like that. Sort of like、um, uh, Road Bull and Elaine from Norgard. Remember those?、Uh, Road Bull got like intelligence and uh, uh, Elaine got the stew plus two. So a little、uh, inside joke there. Okay,、um, anyways, we have a lot of organization to do. So let's go over plans really quick. Decide what we want to do. I'll rearrange everything and then get busy. So the first plan is to make sure that we can take back Garwellen. Now, if we can get this combat power here up and running, we can attack here. However, I do not see Rudo's troop、um, like, staying this low. They're going to summon and bolster this troop. Heavily, what is the summons? Yeah, they've got freaking snakes, rock birds. It's going to be a lot more、uh, combat power because they're going to have the,、uh, the income.、Uh, speaking of that, let's check the income for Mana Silesia.、Uh, let's see. They have 925、uh, income. That means they'll have over 3,000 next season. So, about 3,500. Yeah, almost exactly, actually. So, which is plenty to refill those ranks.、Um, I know they have other places to refill. Like, they have to worry about this castle, this castle, because I'm sitting right here. So, it's a risky thing to, to, to do、um, if I just simply decide to bolster this one up and attack here. That way, I can use this team to attack somewhere else. But if this combat power remains higher than this one, I'm going to have to take Tim's team and attack this way. We won't get attacked from anybody else over here, but still, we're gonna have to like kind of waste a turn. It's not really a waste because we get experience and stuff, but you know, they were successful here, obviously. So I thought we were going to have a second battle over here. They decided to not attack me. I thought that Stella would come in and attack me here or here at the very least, but we stood firm. But we may not be so lucky next time, so we'll see.、Uh, anyways, I'm talking way too much about like those.、Uh, Strategies. I mean, it's strategy, so we can talk about it anyways. But we lost this one as well. We have to do something with Fu Pai and Harmonia. We've got a lot of moving to do. So it's going to take a bit for me to、uh, do all this organization, get a team here, get a team there,、um, bolster the teams at Alternia and Belfarum, and、uh, also questing and stuff like that. So you know the drill. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a break right here, and then I will cut to when I'm ready to commit to the organization phase. We'll hopefully, put another battle in here because the first one was stupid long, but、uh, we'll see which one it is. And if I can fit it, I'll go ahead and put it in. So stay tuned. Okay, that definitely took a while, but after all is said and done, our combat power has officially on Tim's team reached over 20k because I forgot to class up the, the、uh, Wyvern to the Bahamut. We now have a perfect Bahamut right here, and my god, is he beautiful! Oh my goodness, cannot wait to just like. Completely overrun anything that comes near us. You know what I'm talking about? So, like, we're going to plow through Rudo's troop with this team for sure. We just can, we gotta make sure he can't hit Tim. So,、uh, we'll see what happens. But here's the thing they may not actually commit this team to staying here in particular because they have one, two, three.、Um, they have units down here? No. They do have units down here. What the hell are they doing down here? They're probably questing. Uh, four, five. They have five total castles to worry about. And some are much weaker than others, like this one. So they're going to have to divide and conquer if they can. So,、uh, emphasis on the divide. <laughs> Anyways, I'm talking way too much about this. Over here on the left is a hopefully a combined power of, what is it, like 13k or something like that? I'm not going to be able to usurp this combat power whatsoever. So, Even if I come at it from two sides, whoops, 
even if I come at it from two sides, from the north and from the east, I'm still not going to be able to get this attack off first if she decides to come in here and attack me like here or even here. So what I'm going to have to do is to move two other units here instead of, you know, just keeping Al Sin here. Because if they decide to go this way, he can't hold that off. There's no way. So uh, granted, if they do go there, I can attack down here and maybe get a free castle. But regardless, I'm going to have to take two units or two troops from here and bring them over. So it's going to be the top two uh, combat power probably. So we have Xion and Xian potentially. Um, Iona could work as well. She's been doing some work throughout the playthrough. But she doesn't have any heals except for herself, I think. I don't think. Wait, does she have heals? I don't know. I don't think she has heals actually. Um, Anne can go as well. Um, however, I want to train her up some more. Let's see. Let me let me take a look at Allison really quick before we uh, continue. So, two heals from him. Okay, so we really don't need to bring heals from here if we don't want to. But uh, so we can bring over uh, Shein and the Angel, and then we can probably bring over Iona actually, level sixteen, Dragon Man, Drake, and Wyvern, or frontliners. Um, is that a good thing? <laughs> Or do we bring over on? I think... I think I want to bring... <laughs> I think I want to bring on. Yeah, I'll bring on. Okay, so we'll do that. More unicorns is always nice, and we have plenty of front line. Anyway, I should have done that beforehand. My fault on that on that front there. But uh, it's been quite the chore trying to get all this uh, squared away, you know. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and release uh, those two over there because I can't fit them. So they're going to go away. And go away. Okay. So, let's go ahead and commit uh, to the organization phase. I think we're all good to go. Um, I'm moving Ivan from the uh, Norzalio capital. Way over here to bolster uh, Zagust a little bit more. And I'm questing the lowest combat power knight, which is um, Finral, I believe. Yeah, Finral. To um, quest location, try to get some more gear. Because I am lacking heavily on gear this entire time. I haven't been too lucky with gear. Like, I haven't even gotten, what... More than two or three uh three star pieces i'm talking way too much go <laughs> attack we gotta finish this game <laughs> all right so that combat power is lovely this combat power is even more lovely they kept these knights here they're gonna come in and attack me again i don't know where but uh we'll see they may think twice about it because i do have uh two units here um do I actually commit to an attack on their front, though? Because I can. What I can do is attack with um, Alcin, and then two units from here, which would be Alejandro and Coco for sure. Um, well, no, actually, I want to bring the demons, so probably Coco and uh, Malak. Let's see, Alejandro would work well as as well, but uh, I don't know. Like, did <laughs> maybe attack with all of them? You know what I'm wondering? Um, you can let me know if this is true. Does the combat power stack with four uh, knights attacking one castle at the same time? Like, can you up that combat power that way? Because if that's the case, um, then I can take 4,000, 8,000, 12,000, and then Alcin is what? Almost 6,000. So, uh, would that be above? I don't know if that would be above. That might be just, like, enough against her. I don't know. Do I commit to that attack? I kind of want to. I kind of want to. I'll sin. And then choose between these three. You know what? I'm going to try it. I am totally going to try this. Go. Yeah, let me know if the combat power stacks. I haven't been in this situation yet. So, uh, I don't know for sure at this current time. So. Um... Okay, that works. So, Rudo. He kept his unit. Alright, so these are still here. The combat power is back up to 17k. We have to attack him with this team. Because he's just going to go in here and take this for free. Or go up here and take this. And if this gets taken, that's not going to be good. Because we're, we lose a choke point. So, up you go, Tim. Up you go. Tim versus Rudo. First time. 
Hopefully we can come out on top. Get up there. There we go. I'm not used to like picking between a list of castles. I'm used to, you know, having the cursor be free form. Okay, uh, besides that, we can go ahead and just attack from here as well. I'm not going to use any of these units here because, like, the the Tim team is so powerful. Like, why am I not going to just use those to attack? Uh, and here, we may get a defensive battle there. Okay, I think we're good. Let me save it up and then we'll get going. Oh boy, a lot of stuff. <laughs> okay, Tim's team should be first, so we're going to be fighting Rudo. Luckily, we get a defensive battle and also an offense here. Perfect. Let's do it. I'm ready. I'm going to kick your ass. <laughs> you are going down, senor. I don't care how powerful you are. You're going down. Man, if he wasn't overpowered enough, that counter damage up S, man. That is so ridiculous. Okay. We're coming in at a bridge. It's not the best battlefield in the world, but we do have flyers. So we can get around this. We have a lot of ranged. This can work out. Okay. So, um, let's see. Yeah, just go one, two, three, right? Ginger in the middle. Yeah, that'll work. Whoops. Boom. Okay. I'm good with that. Ton of healing. As expected. He's talking to Tim, for sure. Yep. Tenkeだと。それは支配であろう。支配のために古を思いの剣は血を求め続ける。我が剣は違う。真実を示すためにあるのだ。yeah I'm not on board with that program damn damn Tim I love Tim man he's awesome Tim is so cool okay. take your turn Fast forward. Oop. All right, here we go. Let's march, and then I'll see you at the battle. Stay tuned. He's here. Oh, God. Kill this bastard. Kill this bastard. Oh, man. Good. That's all I needed to do is just withstand that one hit with my... MVP Bahamut. And now we're groovy. We are going to screw you up. We are going to screw you up. I'm not even I don't even care about killing all your monsters. You, my friend, are getting focused today. Let's do this. I'm ready. We got venoms coming in, we got curses, we got breath attacks. You are a dead Rudo. You are a dead Rudo. Okay. Let's begin. 61, I mean, it's going to be terrible damage, yes, physically, but we're going to hit him up anyway. So, he's got a null magic buff. Now, like, is that just magic resist up, or what is it specifically? Nullifies all damage and effects of next magic attack. Okay. So, that needs to be a venom or a frost or whatever. I can go ahead and just hit him with uh, Tim's venom or maybe this frost from the mermaid right here. You know what I could do? <laughs> I think he's in range of a charm spell, isn't he? Uh, Lure Song. That's right, he can't be charmed because he's got the Brigandine. Okay, so... If I want to take advantage of Lure Song, um, it might be best to go ahead and Lure Song the Angel, right? To prevent extra heals and then potentially do some more Divine Ray work. This thing could Divine Ray this thing pretty easily but i think we're going in a row so no kyle's in the well, kyle's way back here like <laughs> oh man his support is way back there come on man okay anyways um we should actually do a magic with uh 
Yeah, the um, the Lich, because you have the least intelligence. So this won't hurt him anyways that much. So yeah, 51 damage normally. This will get rid of the Null Magic effect. Beautiful. Right? Yes. Okay, cool. Alright, let's start hitting him up. Hitting him up. <laughs> I can't speak today. Well, let's see. 98. Yeah. We're going to blow him up. We are going to blow him up with magic. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. You thought you were big and bad, didn't you? No, sir. Not today. Didn't I just do this? Did wait, 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 wait. Didn't I just... Oh, maybe I backed out. I could have sworn I breath attacked him already. <laughs> okay. I probably backed out. That's the only logical conclusion, right? So, all right, let's go ahead and do a curse, I suppose. You're at 18. Uh, I won't be able to kill him. So yeah, curse, then frost, and then get a kill with somebody. Don't know who that's going to be yet. 233. That's the worst part of having a whole bunch of white orbs, man. All the, all three of those black orbs that I hit him with a curse proc every single white orb on his defense. And he has like six or some shit. So, um, do I even need to do a frost? Yeah, I need to do frost. Forget the whole, uh, you know, wanting to charm the stuff. I mean, I'm in a great position for it, so, but... He's in the exact position that I wanted him to be in, so we're good to go. Here's our new perfect wyvern. So excited to see that. Um, 70 damage. Oh, you're awesome, aren't you? Let's see. Um, yeah, I mean, do this, but okay, yeah. I can't set up the kill for the wyvern or the Bahamut. That's fine. Stand by. You're going to do a frost. Nope, no curse, please. Frost. 151. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. You know what? I may get the kill with Tim. Just to be thematic about it, because, uh, well, I can't. He's not next. Right. Um. Heal the Bahamut. Yes. Yeah, I already did a Venom attack with Tim. I don't know why my turn just got turned around today. It was kind of weird, but I think it's because I had to stop abruptly. I had a little glitch. All right, let's see. Might as well move and get some hits, right? Mm, sure. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, we'll definitely be able to put two battles in because <laughs> this one's going to be super short. <laughs> So, regardless, this needed to happen because uh, he had the combat power. Hmm. I guess we're getting the kill with the uh, the Lilith, which I'm totally fine with. Uh, but yeah, you can't get in there to, uh, to hit him. So, before we commit to that, let's uh, go ahead and do some more spells here. Go ahead and heal. Why not? Doesn't matter. Probably do a weakness, get Sylvie in there, do a physical hit, and then do this, uh, have the centaur hit as well. So, do weakness first. I don't think I'll have enough to kill it, but, you know, I'm just having fun at this point. Oh man, you can't get into one space in the water on there. Are you in the water already? No, you're not. That's weird. Okay, that's fine. We'll just do this. This way, then. I wanted to um, end with Sylvie, but that's okay. It's not going to work anyways, doesn't matter. So. Still nice damage, though, so get that experience. Move in, do one more shot, and then Venom for the win. Almost killed it, too. Maybe a crit would have done it. All right. Or, <laughs> hear me out. <laughs> we could just be to your doom. <laughs> Uh, where would the space be? It'd be right here. We'll be cl we'll be fine, clearly, but... I wonder if that... Oh, man, that would be so close in killing the angel, too. Oh, man. I'll kill the snake as well. And, of course, also kill Rudo, but... Yeah, why would you not do it, right? I know it's ridiculous, but... No, this is the optimal spot right here, isn't it? 
It it doesn't matter. Just rain rain hellfire. Rain hellfire. Boom. I'll stop here for you. Okay. Well, thank you. Appreciate you, buddy. Bye. We captured the angel. Allah. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Them levels for that uh for that Lilith. Good stuff. Awesome. Well, there's battle number two, so we'll we'll call it there. <laughs> so before we quit, of course, we'll uh, talk about what we're gonna do next episode since I have extra time now. And uh, yeah, that was fun. So we still have other attacks going on this round, obviously, but uh, we'll see if Gaimol comes and attacks me. Probably will. Morelva also has a chance to attack me as well. They have like what 16k, almost 17k combat power. So what is the next invasion? I wonder. Place your bets. <laughs> awesome. Capture the angel. Rudo's gone. Boom. Easy. Okay, what we got? We actually got the attack off. Nice, nice, nice. All right, this will be a fun one because I think we'll take the top three right here. Allison's definitely coming in from the other side. And uh, yeah, this will be my first uh, surround battle. So this uh, that'll be pretty cool. So we'll get into the battle, plop down, see what the uh, battlefield looks like. And then we will call it there for today. Thank you so much for joining me. This was awesome. If you need to uh, have access to any of my guide videos, you can always find that in the top right-hand corner of these videos, typically. But uh, this one I'll definitely put in there, in there for sure. If you're wanting some more assistance with the game. So, uh, let's see. Yeah, Allison for sure. Alejandro for sure. And then, do we go Coco? Or do we go Malak and then Demon? I think Malak, actually. Uh, yeah, let's go Malik. Sounds good. He got a little boost from uh, seeing his daughter again, so we'll put that to use, I suppose. Still gonna be a hard fight, um, but hopefully we'll come out on top. Igazol also means watch this. <laughs> Doesn't Ikazo mean, um, let's go? By the way, thank you all for, uh, a side note, thank you all for, uh, translating a lot of my questions that I have for, like, the dialogue, just for fun. It's, uh, you know, you all have a lot of knowledge, so <laughs> thank you for putting that to good use. It really, uh, flares up the, um, the liveliness of these, uh, comment sections and stuff like that. Anyway, I've talked way too much for the entire time here. I am exhausted. I need to get some more recording done and also sleep. So, but anyways, a lot of fun as always. I love the game so much. Um, still can't believe it's actually here. But uh, if you want any more access to Brigandine resources, you know what to do. Go in the description, check that out. You can have access to the wiki page, the subreddit page, Discord server. Please join that up. We are still getting uh, members in there every single day. And um, it's booming, man. I always say it, but like it's, it's, the growth is amazing. I still can't wait to see like what it's going to look like, like, next month and then the next month after that even a year from now i'll have to compare like members and stuff like that because i think we started with um what like 200 and some when we uh first uh but before the game released and as soon as the game released we started like ramping up and up and up and now it's probably well above 400 maybe even 500 by now i don't even know i've lost count anyways way too much talking as i said before Please check the description for uh, any Brigandine resources. Also check the top right-hand corner for my guide video playlist if you want additional assistance on the game, including the uh, quest guides that I've been releasing. All of those are planned out and ready to go. Um, and then look forward to next episode. I think that's going to be two days from now. Yeah, it's always two days. So like every other day, I'll be releasing an episode of the playthrough itself. And in between that will be either another video that I've uh, pre-recorded or a guide video for the game itself, which there are more to come in our schedule. Anyways, I am your host, Dago Sonari. I will see you on the next episode. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, comment below with your experiences, all that good stuff, and I will catch you in the next episode. See you on the battlefield, Rune Knights. Peace.